My name is David Hewson. I'm the author of The Fallen Angel, which is the tenth book I've now set in modern Italy. The, the Fallen Angel is a kind of modern crime story set in today's Rome, but very much with historical antecedents. And like all of my books, it's set in a very specific part of Rome. In this case, it's set in the ghetto, which is a tiny area right in the heart of Rome that actually not many tourists go to, but is full of lots and lots of interesting stories. The story behind this one, the seed, the spark for it, is an amazing real-life historical tragedy that goes back to the 16th century concerning uh, a young woman called Beatrice Cenci. Now, Beatrice was the daughter of an aristocratic family who owned most of the ghetto. And uh, the father of that family was known for being a brutal, nasty man. One day the father is found dead outside his castle in the countryside. It looks like an accident, but actually it turns out it isn't. The family had ganged up on him, they'd had enough of his, of his abuse, and they turned around and murdered him. And the Pope's policemen come in and discover this and put the family on trial and eventually sentenced them to death. Now, the people of Rome got to hear about this story and rose up in defense of Beatrice, um, but that didn't matter because the Pope decided they're all going to be executed. And at the time, it was a huge, huge story. People painted it, people wrote poetry about it. Later, Alexander Dumas wrote a novel about it. Shelley wrote a play about it. And Beatrice became this icon for virtue standing up against brutality, and, and still is for the Romans today. You can feel that spirit of Beatrice is still alive in Rome. It's a place that's full of ghosts. And I very soon discovered that I could visit the palace that's still there where Beatrice lived. The point at which she was and her family were executed is now the busy road right by the bridge by the Castel Sant'Angelo. And the really scary thing is that eventually I got into the Black Museum of the State Police. And when you go in there, you can see the actual sword that the executioner used. So out of this historical mix, I tried to create what's effectively a modern murder mystery story. Somebody has died in a way that appears to be connected to the Chenchi story. There is a young woman who appears to be very much like Beatrice Chenchi. And my team of detectives have to unravel this quite dark family tragedy that's happening in the modern day that seems to mirror something that happened 500 years ago. It's a mix of ancient and modern that I think really reflects how, how Rome is today.